Hello and welcome back everyone, uh, Ninja Prime here. In this short tutorial video I'm just going to show you how to convert .aac files into .mp3 files. Now the quickest way uh, to do this, it, it's been suggested that you just named and uh, change the name file at the end of um, the actual file itself to .mp3. This can work sometimes but nine times out of ten it fails to do so and you end up getting a corrupted file so the best way to do this it's to and the way I've found to do this really quickly and simply is to in, do it through Audacity. Now Audacity is a free tool that you can use an audio software piece of software that's free that you can actually use it can convert files for you and everything like that the only thing that you might need as well for this is a file called it's this file it's called an FFmpeg dot win and it's 2.2.2.2 um, it's basically uh, a set of files that will convert let me just extract this if for some reason um, when you try and convert an audacity file and it comes up saying that the ffmpeg dot win uh, files are not present it's just a case of downloading the actual files themselves and you can do that through audacity itself if we go into preferences and you go into libraries and it's here so all you basically need to do is you can download it from here or actually downloaded it and just locate it and away it goes so it's the lame mp3 export library that you really need so once that's all installed and you've got it all in place it's just a simple case of importing the audio file that you want so in this case if we go to the desktop I've got the file here but example file here so if we open that audacity will then import it and there you go from here you can edit this as much as you want you can even turn it into a mono stream but that's entirely up to you once you've done it you can export it and then you'll have the option here to export it as an mp3 a WAV file or an OGG file from here so export as mp3 just click on that it'll ask you for a destination folder uh, we'll keep it in audacity itself you can rename it here um, new file and save it it'll also ask you to put a title and everything artist name if you want to entirely up to you once you're happy with that just click OK and audacity will do its thing as you can see from here this only takes a few seconds uh, depending on the speed of your machine my machine is a few years old so it, it will take its time but there you go that's it file job done okay thank you for watching ninja prime out